are you, MJ? Crap. Reach him? That place is crawling with guards. How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Standish is somewhere in there. Gotta get past that guard. Time to see if these lures Pete gave me work. That gap in the fence looks promising. Just need to distract the guard. Out of the way, fella. Gotta move. Now. Gonna check on our house guest. Stay here. Copy. House guest. Must be Standish. He's here somewhere. What the? What's that? Demons are killing anyone related to Devil's Breath. Standish is in real danger. Got it. Time to move. Standish. I knew it. I've got to get to that tent. him for long. Bravo and Charlie are both on deck for Dr. Michael's relocation, ma'am. Add two more units. He carries the only sample of Devil's Breath. I will not be responsible for pandemic. Looks important. Safe houses. If Dr. Michaels is in one of these, Standish might know which one. There's Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries devil's breath around with him. Osborne doesn't trust anyone else to secure it. I hope his ego doesn't bite him in the ass. Or us. Control, grid clear. Repeat, grid clear. Close. 
Come on, come on. Charles Standish? Holy crap! Charles, where is Dr. Morgan Michaels? Lee sent you. Didn't he? No. Okay. He wants to kill me? You tell him to do it. Do it himself. I'm not with the demons. I'm not with Sable. I'm a reporter. And I want to see Lee stopped. Just like you. Watson. I've read your byline. Sable won't listen to me. She has Michaels in the Bowery. They're moving him to a new safe house tomorrow at noon. But she's totally ignoring Grand Central. Grand Central? The demons were talking about it when they held me. They're going there to get... To get what, Charles? What do the demons need to get at Grand Central? <laughs> what the... Charles! Oh, what that the was hell? not a sable guy. Definitely not a sable guy. Sorry, Charlie. Okay, time to Wait, go. No, he knows something. Well, that was maybe the most awkward swing of my life. MJ is not happy. Hey, okay, another thing. Sorry, Charlie. You knock a man out, destroy my background research, and the best you've got is sorry, Charlie? Is everything a joke to you? What? MJ, no, I, I screwed up. It, it was a tension breaker. Tension breaker, right. You know, this is exactly why we broke up. I thought we broke up so you could focus on your career. We broke up because you wouldn't stop treating me like a baby. Don't do this, MJ. Don't do that, MJ. Oh, that's too dangerous, MJ. I may not have super spider powers, but I'm not made out of glass. You snuck into the middle of an armed military... You know what? Can we not do this right now, please? Did you learn anything about Dr. Michaels? <sighs> Fine. Michaels is in the Bowery somewhere. Sable's moving him tomorrow at noon. Awesome. Anything else? Was he saying something about Grand Central before I jumped in? He was... No. It was nothing. Listen, I gotta go, Peter. Filing deadline. Peter. That's how you know she's still mad. Peter. Nice work, Mr. Superhero. Man, I'm worked up. Gotta blow off some steam on patrol. Shoot a weapon. Hey, Spider Man. There's another missing student. Latest MIA is Steve Hopkins. What worries me about him is some guys from Tombstone's gang started dealing in his neighborhood recently. Steve hated that. It's a nice area, but he was too scared to do anything. If he's corrupted, he might take out his anger on them, and he's the one who'd get hurt. This is the last picture Steve put up before he went silent. I couldn't find anything more recent. Huh, pretty sure this is the Upper West Side. I think I need to head north.
Philip, what can you tell me about Steve? He's a little guy. Wouldn't hurt a fly. I'm not sure he could if he wanted to. Sounds like these dealers would crush him. And a little guy might burn out quicker. I better hurry. If I can find a park on the west side, next to water, I can use it to track the location. This Steve guy sounds like he's all responsibility, but no power. I hope I can get there in time. Tombstone's gang might not be as bulletproof as their boss, but they're almost as deadly. There's the park. The photo must have been taken around here somewhere. I think that's the spot over by those trees. Damn, son, you got a death wish? Hey, fellas, let's take college boy to school. That corrupted guy bit off more than he could chew. Guess I have to rescue him before I cure him. Those guys are armed. Maybe I can take some of them quietly. All clear, Steve. Let's get... Steve! Come on, I just saved you! I'll kill you! This is what they call tough love. Oh, God. What did I do? I always had a problem with those guys, but... I, I, tonight, I wanted to kill him in ways I don't even want to think about. Don't worry. This wasn't your fault. This is not how I met the gang. Peter, I'm about to begin another test. Oh, sorry. My bus broke down and there were no cabs. But I'll be there as soon as I can. Miles is mom. Hello? Mr. Parker? It's Drio Morales. I want to thank you for getting Miles the job at the feast shelter. Glad to. And please call me Peter. Mr. Parker is probably someone more together than me. I should tell you, he has reservations. I finally gave him a choice. This or more therapy. He needs this. He just hates to feel like a victim or be pitied. Gotcha. I'm the same way. I'll let Ed May know, and I'll make sure I'm there his first day. Thank you again. This means a lot to both of us.
Spider-Man! Spider-Man, I've got a lot more missing students. The debate club never showed for a meet today. All vanished at once. A coordinated attack. Things are escalating. What's their last known location? The club president, Harold, showed up in a tourist's photo stream. The Brooklyn Bridge is definitely in this photo. That's southeast of the university. Vacation ever. Look out! Need direction. I can head to the eastern shoreline and go south from there. Must be them. Trucks leave the gas. If it blows, it'll take out the whole block. They're causing sparks every time they hit the truck. Don't you guys have something better to do than blow yourselves up? You were confused. Flammable and inflammable mean the same thing. <sighs> Thank you. I, I knew what I was doing was wrong, but I, I couldn't stop myself. Sounds like a typical college student. You'll be all right now. Spider-Man, we just caught a sniper stalking Mayor Osborne's chief of staff. Pretty sure there are other targets. Our perp had a map of the city with the courthouse circled. I'm on it. See if you can get more info out of our friend here and contact me at this number. I need to hurry. The attack on the courthouse could come any second. Sniper sees me near the target. He'll take the shot. Only chance is to take out the gunman before he can fire. Sleep it off. Nobody likes a camper. Spider-Man! We accessed the perp's phone. Found more names and locations. Looks like it's all going down within a matter of minutes. No pressure. Send me what you got. Multiple snipers, one Spider-Man. I need to move fast. Anyone who's ever worked on Norman's campaign is a potential target now. That's one way to destroy Osborne, I guess. Make it so nobody wants to be around him. This is the place. Now where's the assassin? I literally didn't see that coming. One down, two to go.
gotta check out all possible vantage points for snipers. Shh. Target safe. Only one to go. If I'm too slow, people die. Sniper's gotta be around here somewhere. Sweet dreams. Just in time. Officer, all three snipers are down. Are we in the clear? Not quite. Our perp says his boys are holding a bunch of tourists hostage. He says they'll execute them all if we don't let them go. We have a probable location based on cell phone towers. But if they see cops, they'll start shooting. Act like you're negotiating. Stall them. I'll take away their bargaining chips. They won't leave witnesses. Either I save the hostages, or they're dead. See me, they can kill all the hostages before I get close. Our demands are simple. Release our comrades, or the hostages die. We're working with the DA to meet your demands. If I'm spotted, those hostages are dead. Gotta take out these guys quietly. You will pay with their blood. Every minute you waste brings you closer to bloodshed. All right, the release of your friends is being scheduled.
不是我的幻觉。枪只不过是宫中为安全的火柴，受伤。Ready night. Thanks again, Spider-Man. This could have turned ugly. I wouldn't have known about it if not for you. We make a good team, officer. Hey, see if you can convince more of your buddies to work with me instead of shooting at me, okay? Our next caller reports a problem I saw coming a mile away. Go ahead, ma'am. Well, I was coming out of the bathtub last night when I glanced out my window, and, and what do I see? Spider-Man, swinging by like he owns the place. I was naked. Madam, you have my sympathies. Just imagine what sort of deviant personality would dress up like that in the first place. And it's a short step from there to peeping Tom activity. Folks, it doesn't matter if you live on the first floor or the 31st. Keep your curtains drawn. Lock your windows. A webbed pervert walks among us! Could you just Spider-Man. Like Spider-Man, we have a crisis situation. The football team went to an away game, never made it back. They found the buses abandoned. Team, fans, staff, Lee has an army out there. Any leads? Someone recognized the quarterback, Brad Davis, posted a picture. Hold on. That looks like Washington Square Arch. I think this is next to ESU. They're like a pack of wolves. The longer this goes on, the more likely someone dies. He can't hurt me. He protects me. How many players on a roster again? You're a monster! I call the other! First time I've wished our team had fewer fans!
wish they'd been this persistent against state. Finally over? Oh, that was crazy. I was crazy. You're not the first one this happened to. Good news is, doctors check the others and they don't have any lasting effects. Oh, thanks. I don't know how to repay you. Beat the Wildcats on Saturday and we'll call it even. You did it. All the missing students are accounted for. Good to hear. Maybe now things can get back to normal. Oh, I miss normal. Right there with you, buddy. Enemy of my enemy is probably also my enemy. But I still okay, the people in the top four apartments are really annoyed with you right now. Save a lot of put me on the payroll. Officers respond. We've got a ten ten narcotic cell in progress. Officers needed in Central Park. Wouldn't be New York without a seedy drug deal. Oh, come on, fellas. You can't keep ducking income tax like this. I will crush your tiny bones.
Huh. Fisk did keep these wannabe pushers in check. Wait a minute, what's that feeling? Do I... Mid Mugging. Needed officer on the scene. Officers needed in Central Park. Someone's getting robbed. Who wants a picture? Mugger thinks he's the next Wilson Fisk. Well, they are going to jail, so... Here in on alert. The kidnapping was just reported. Please mobilize on Museum Mile. My suit's onboard AI can tell me the most likely area where the victim is. Can you, like, uh, lift something heavy? Come on out. Stretch your legs. Let me thought I was getting out of here. Thank you. There! Those are the guys who did it! We've got a situation involving civilians trapped in their vehicles. Officers near Vanderbilt, be advised. Car wreck down there. Bad.
that debris is trapping someone inside that car. everyone. Glad I was here to help. You're a mensch, Spider-Man. from the rapidly shrinking yet still stubbornly obtuse contingent of Spider-Man fanboys and fangirls blithely insisting he did a wonderful thing, shutting down a drug lab run by a delightful fellow whose street name seems to be, wait for it, Tombstone. Now, I'm glad he's behind bars, but do you know how Spider-Man shut this operation down? By setting it on fire. Do you know what drug labs do when you set them on fire? They explode! Spider-Man could have taken out the entire block with his criminally reckless grandstanding. Fortunately, New York's bravest, our firefighters, contained the blaze because that's their job. And if Spider-Man had any sense, he'd have turned over whatever information he had on Tombstone to the police and let New York's finest do their job. But no. He thought the best way to handle drug dealing is with arson! Sugar Hill Garrison, this is Control. What's your status? Demons are attacking Outpost Romeo. Sent back up. Better step in before they rack up a body count. Okay, the people in the top floor apartments are really annoyed with you right now. for you, but no need to pay me. Action is my reward. All units, we have a hostage situation involving a civilian bus. Nearest officer, please proceed to Manhattanville. on a tourist bus. That's a New York reality tour for you.
Doc's getting another test up. Better get to the lab to help. Hey, sorry I'm late. Morning, Parker. Or is it evening? That doesn't matter. Check the neurosensors, would you? We need a faster response time. On it. Try to get it under three milliseconds. Okay, looks like I could optimize this power relay. Nice. Okay, what next? It looks like some impedance in this neurosensor circuit. Finished. Signal to noise is out of whack. A new signal processor should reduce lag.
I got it, Doc. 2.8 milliseconds. Good work, Peter. I call that a mild success. I call that unbelievable. Do you need some help? Yes. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but... it can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Uh, if you'd like to seek a position with more of a future... I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Oh, Peter, before I forget, I read the most fascinating article. Outlines possible next steps for the neural interface. I'll take a look. Thanks, Doc. Doc loves these things. He used them in grad school when he had to manipulate radioactive isotopes. He says seeing them keeps him humble. The device will need two parts to function. The first will be an entirely original prosthesis, a modular system of micro cables able to take on any number of forms, whatever the user can imagine. The second part, and this, Peter, is the true genius, is a direct neural interface, a direct tap straight into the basal ganglia. Unleash the brain from your mind to reality. This goes beyond limb replacement, Peter. This will free all of us from the shackles of our bodies. Like your web friend, soon we'll all be capable of living our most amazing fantasies. Let's take a look.
That did it. Time for some science. That looks right. Wonder if I could 3D print a web shooter. Can't believe I've never tried that. Peter is starting to suspect. He hides it, but I can tell. He's seen my twitch, noticed the decay of my fine motor control. Well, I'm the one who wanted a genius for an assistant. Of course he knows. I just need more time. My work can improve millions of lives. Save millions of lives. It can also save my own. I just need more time. Direct interface with the basal ganglia. Exciting, but risky. I don't know, Doc. You'll need a gallium silk array to make it work. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Gallium! Genius! Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. And if we're not careful, an intracranial implant could make things even worse. Even alter his personality. We need to proceed carefully. Um, Doc, I'm sorry. My aunt just texted. No worries, Peter. I was thinking of taking a break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Thanks. I'll be back in a few hours. Gonna miss that humorless grimace. Mob enforcer turned walking tank. 
Rhino's racked up enough property damage to destroy Manhattan three times over. Vulture might be the smartest guy up on this wall. Not smart enough to duck three consecutive life sentences, of course, but still pretty brainy. <laughs> Electro was the first legit super-powered villain I fought. Till then, it had been regular guys in fancy suits. Electro was a big change. Big change. Last time I fought Scorpion, he asked if I knew what my skull looked like from the inside. Then offered to show me. Super fun guy. What is this, Doc? Never seen this type of material. Would you believe it's for welding? Provides remarkable magnetic insulation and limits cross-contamination between the neural interface and arms. 